Watching out for you, Colorado Gives Day, one of the nation's largest, one of our state's largest online giving events taking place across Colorado today. Thousands of nonprofits participating as some continue to struggle to survive and adapt to the increased need during the pandemic. And New Size Mayo Davison, she is live with how this year is more important than ever, Mayo. It's been a tough few months for local nonprofits as they navigate the pandemic with less financial support and assistance. But now with Colorado Gives Day, they're hoping the community will rally and provide them with much needed support. With the pandemic worsening, local nonprofits getting hit hard, but not letting any obstacles get in their way of helping those in need. We have more people who need food through care and share because so many people have lost their jobs or their impacted in so many different ways and we need to help them even more. Karen Share seeing a larger demand this year because of COVID-19. The organization setting a goal of $60,000 for Colorado Gives Day and already reaching it. But that doesn't mean that over our goal doesn't matter because the more money that comes in, the more money we get, the more food we can acquire and the more people we can serve. Donations received through the online event will help care and share distribute more food to the community and through local partners. The Springs Rescue Mission also relying on Colorado Gives Day for a big boost. Every year it's important, but this year has been so challenging. Uh, to hear from this community has meant so much as our teams have been on the front line battling this pandemic, trying to keep homeless neighbors safe. The nonprofit setting a goal of $25,000 this year to help in their mission. So with this Colorado Gives Day, we're going to be putting funds to provide extra layers of safety for our guests at the Springs Rescue Mission during this pandemic. Hoping to use the donations for plexiglass barriers between the shelter beds and more meals. Another nonprofit looking to benefit from Colorado Gives Day, the Humane Society of the Pikes Peak Region. Our revenue has decreased. We have seen a large demand for adoptions, but we're not taking in as many animals. We've also had to suspend a lot of our programs this year. With the organization getting hit hard this year, they're hoping to use the donations to help with the rehabilitation and surgeries. It can uh, take a lot of resources, a lot of time, a lot of medication to get all these pets healthy. And with over 5,000 procedures done every year and with less assistance, they say community support is especially needed now. For those interested in donating to any of these nonprofits or one of your choice, we'll have a link to the Colorado Gives website on KOA.com. And as a reminder, be sure to keep that receipt for your records. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs. Mayo Davison. News 5. Mayo, thanks. And during this year's Colorado Gives Day, more than 2,900 nonprofits in our state will benefit from your donations. And we have all that, as Mayo just said, right now, koaa.com, or you can go to coloradogives.org.